clean rutting out of here on Max Creek right here. This spot right here is so special because I've killed some of my biggest deer and some of my greatest memories right here and hunted here when I was just a boy. Hunted this morning on the knoll where my dad hunted when I was a kid. Brady got a 10 pointer last night. Let's go. We're about to show you how we roll on some raptors, Gen 2 and Gen 3 at deer camp. Let's go. So I drove my dad's folder this morning back to the stand. And of course you can see the glory from last night. And Brady's right here. Tell me about your hunt this morning, big dog. Uh, only saw one doe, but- Where'd you hunt? Right you, hunt right, you hunt right there in the, in the salt lick box, right? Yep. Now, tell me about yesterday evening. Last night, so get down here, took some finals at school yesterday, passed them, did pretty good on them. Yeah. Come down to camp, and we get in real late, about an hour later than we usually do. And first 30 minutes, didn't really see much action or anything. And then about 20 minutes left of my hunt, looked to my right, kind of like right center, and there's two does over there, and then there's this pretty good buck. I was like, oh yeah, he comes in the field, I'm gonna get him. And he comes in right where I knew he was gonna come in, and I just let him eat it. Good 10 pointer. Uh, second biggest Georgia buck. Yep. Right? Uh, you think you can show these boys and girls how we like to do with the raptors at deer camp? Oh yeah. Let's do. So I told you about Brady killing the 10 pointer. He shot a deer, a bigger buck the night before. We just got through hunting Sunday morning and we were looking for him, just trying one last ditch effort. And we see buzzards right down the street right here. We found him y'all, check this out. Nine pointer, Brady got a nine pointer. He came through y'all. People were doubting him saying, oh, he but just missed it, but he come through with it. Unbelievable. Now he's about to take a little victory lap. Be the victory lap back to camp. Yep. He said they didn't believe in us. They didn't believe in us. Yes, Brady. A nine pointer in the very next afternoon, same stand, 10 pointer. About the same time too. It's at the same time. Unbelievable. This is what, I man, this makes me so proud. I know he's so proud too. This is so special, y'all. Let's ride. That's what we call the redneck 
car wash. We are done at deer camp for the weekend. Brady and I are riding there. The babe is riding in the silver one. She's got Bandit. I want to show you a little bit of roller shots of off-road action at deer camp. So the Gen 3 37 pack is looking so mean with the iconic silver, race red accents. Man, this is such a special one. Uh, you know, I've changed those tires multiple times. I've had trails on it in 37, 13 and a half, 22. This is a more conservative BFG KM3 and it handles perfectly. We got 17 by nine TIS wheels in negative 12 offsets. You see, we still got that Bulldog stance on it and uh 12 and a half wide versus 13 and a half wide we've got no issue with articulation on that one more so on this one here the race red has more uh, issues as far as flex and articulate because we got mt tires and we've got a more bolsterous overall package there but that's what we know y'all we know what works and what doesn't work and we know what off-roads and what will not off-road this is obviously very mild off-roading besides a little bit of mud action but we love coming out here and just kicking it sideways and having fun at deer camp been a successful trip hunted down in this area all my life and the beavers have it dammed up so everything's flooding had a lot of rain right here so good opportunity to showcase a little bit of a uh, water fording in the raptors we got gen 2 and gen 3 the wifey and bandit Back to back. Memorable weekend at deer camp, riding four wheelers, riding raptors, and hunting big bucks. And Brady, oh, I'm so proud of him. A nine pointer, and then the next afternoon, same spot, almost same time, a 10 pointer. Truly blessed, thank the Lord. We thank God for everything. All our blessings we know come from him. And we're headed home. We got a lot of cleaning up to do. I got some videos to edit, this one as well, to bring you on the daily, so. We're going non-stop, but Christmas is a week away, so Merry Christmas to you. Gen 2 and the Gen 3, we are a Raptor family, no doubt.